Hey everyone, welcome back to Two Idiots Review. I'm Caleb. I'm Hannah, and we are getting ready to watch the first episode of Loki. Um, yeah, that's it. That's what we're doing. <laughs> I yeah. was gonna say like we didn't, you know, we couldn't stay up at like till midnight. Oh yeah, so we're work posting and... this a little late because you know we have jobs and stuff. Unfortunately, unfortunately, this, this... this isn't our job. <laughs> yeah, so you, you, YouTube doesn't pay the bills yet. <laughs> that's um, not even close. Or but, any, actually. you know, <laughs> but we're excited for, uh, for the series. I feel like I don't really know, like, the show could go anywhere, I feel like, even more so than WandaVision did, whereas, you Well, know, yeah, because they've taken, a, you know, a of, like, lot of... Uh, there's different time timelines, there's, yeah. you know, different time periods, there, I mean, the show could literally go anywhere and do anything, so, like, we have no idea what to expect, um, so that's, you know, that's something exciting. Um... Uh, that's but yeah, that's yeah. all I have, so, yeah, so we're going to watch the episode. Let's just watch. 2012. I mean, I could just watch it. Game. Be <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. What do you think? Maximum occupancy has been reached. Take the steps. Yes. <laughs> stop, stop. <laughs> I like get like reshoot some some of these. Well, we'll no, focus those on him. are those are from Endgame. Yeah, but that, like that close up of Loki's oh, face. Oh, that close up. Yeah. Or he was like waving. <laughs> Mongolia. That's where he went to. He could tra transport himself anywhere in the cold galaxy. Oh, Mongolia. Maybe when you're holding it like that, it's harder to control where you go. <laughs> Very reminiscent of Iron Man in the desert when he uh, crashed. Yeah, that I am your ruler. I am Loki. Does he have the high ground? <laughs> of Asgard. And I am burdened with glorious purpose. Find it. In the act, you see. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> okay, so they're taking Loki out of the out, out of that, of the and then kind of resetting it, yeah. so that way it's, the branch no longer exists. What would they normally do if they didn't want to keep Loki alive? Like when they just normally just kill the variants? <laughs> What is this place? I can't. Scroll? Four of gold. One little call, and your whole job is done. Hey, Max. Hey. Hey. Hey, 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 Please sign to verify this is everything you've ever said. <laughs> sign this too. <laughs> oh, this is absurd. I feel like that should be a bigger piece of paper. And this. And a bigger stack. This confirmed to your knowledge that you are not a fully robotic being. We're born an organic creature and do, in fact, possess what many cultures would call a soul. What? To my knowledge. <laughs> Do a lot of people not know if they're robots? Thank you for your confirmation. Please move through. <laughs> what if I was a robot and I didn't know it? <laughs> the machine would melt you from the inside out. Please move along, sir. They've left you without a place on the timeline. You must stand trial for your offenses. We're going to see, like, Steve Sit Rogers in here. We'll in <laughs> yeah, I've seen people time. say... Just make that. sure you have your ticket and you'll be seen by the next available attendant. <laughs> Ticket, <laughs> sir. We need some great grace in your place with me, Buckethead. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for visiting the TVA. 
Don't hesitate to let us know how we're doing. Désolé. Mon ami, il est imbécile. Hey yo! Voici, je parle tout le long de la table. Espèce d'homme. Well, I feel like imbécile. Like, that's pretty easy to... <laughs> like, I don't know what else he said, but he definitely said imbecile. <laughs> Mephisto? <laughs> yeah, Mephisto. <laughs> Mephisto? Yeah. The creator I came out was like, that was just a coincidence. Like, afraid of us. We're going to take care of him. But you, <laughs> you like, oh crap, we shouldn't have done that. Like, now everyone's going to be all mad, but it's not. People are going to be jumping to conclusions. No, that's why he was just like, so right, cool. that's not what that is. I it really is the Jetsons. Here. What is it? That's a cool place. It's time we should be living, but... I don't know. If COVID didn't happen, this would be 2021 right now. <laughs> Why does some of their technology look so primitive? <laughs> and then other parts of it are super advanced. <laughs> I was young man lost a bet to Thor. Where was the TVA when I was meddling with these affairs of men? Well, we were right there with you, just surfing that sacred timeline. Also, that had the timekeeper's seal of approval, did it? If you hadn't picked up the Tesseract, you would have been taken to a cell on Asgard. <laughs> I think it's just like a recap on the Loki. Nonsense. More tricks. It's never even happened. You might want to take the stairs to the left. But instead, you send them. Um... I'll never tell. <gasps> I don't think I ever pieced together that that's the reason that the Dark Elves were in that room was because of Loki. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, yep. Uh. His fault. Where do you have her? Where is she? <laughs> Time Twister just loops you, not the furniture. <laughs> you were born to be king, Loki. You were born to cause pain and suffering and death. That's how it is. That's how it was. That's I feel like the Tesseract always looks different every time like, they do it. Infinity stones. <laughs> how, how do you have these? Oh, we actually get a lot of those. Yeah, some of the guys use them as paperweights. <laughs> Some of them. I love you, my sons. Remember this place. Oh. So bad after all, brother. Maybe not. Thank you. If you're here, I might even give you a hug. <laughs> I'm here. He's like, I'll do my little trickety trick. Anyway. Oh, that's cool. Okay. And now they have a, a little 
charge thing that can destroy your time bomb. Of course, that's the end of the episode. I mean, this was a, you know, it was an interesting opening episode for the series. Um, one thing I don't like is how they've kind of downplayed, like, the Infinity Stones. And they're just like, you know, it's always been like, oh, these are, you know, the most powerful well, things in, in the universe. In there, and then, like, well, I know, but it still kind of diminishes the, the power of it. I mean, like, the TVA could have come and stopped Thanos at any time if they wanted to. I mean, I guess the thing is that they just didn't want to because that's how it was supposed to happen. But still, I don't know. It seems like to, to, it seems to diminish the power of the Infinity Stones, and I don't like that. But all in all, it's still a good episode. It's like, I don't think it's that part of it. <laughs> and Chris, um, I was like, I was, I mean, I expected there to be like some humor, but it's a lot, it was a lot funnier than I was expecting it to be. Well, I mean, it's a Loki show. Well, I mean. I, I said, I expected some humor, but I wasn't expecting it. <clears throat> and Owen Wilson, I mean, you got like the masters of comedy up in here. What? So, I mean, this is going to be a, you know, a short season, six episodes, with only five episodes left already. Um, well, and like they sent out two to all for like all the press and all that, so I was wondering if they were going to release two today, but I guess they just did one. Like we don't have enough episodes to uh, to do that. Although I mean, I mean they're going to have Black Widow being released at the same time. I wonder if that's why they released them on. They decided to change it to Wednesdays because Black Widow would be coming out on Friday, and they wouldn't want could be. Loki to be out on on that same Friday. Um. Yeah, so, I mean, you know, something to look forward to. I feel like this is, you know, has a lot of potential to be a, a good series. I mean, yeah. Just, I'm curious as to... <laughs> I mean, I'm not sure I'm a fan of having him, like, already been down to Earth and, like, doing all... I mean, I'm sure they all came at some, you know, to visit and whatever, but just having him, like... like he said, he, like, he lost a bet to Thor I or something. Know, and had to, like, like do that. I mean, you know. But that he was, like, actually, like, D.B. Cooper and all that stuff. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> hmm. Which, when I saw that, you know, I saw that in the trailers when he was jumping out of the plane oh, and being... Like, is he D.B. But I thought that was, like... Well, no, he but went back in time to do you know something not like that would had already happened. Well, no, them. but not even that. But I, you know, they showed like the Rainbow Bridge coming to get him, and I was like, oh, I was like Thor's gonna be like in the show, and now I've dashed all my all my yeah, hopes of Thor being in it. And I thought I thought some different variant of Thor and all that. I was like, oh, like that'd be kind of like a cool surprise, you know, cool thing to do. And now they just already dashed my dreams in the first episode. He was in it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they all were. Uh huh. You have to see them all. We got to see a recap of the end game and well, it would have been uh we got to see a little Loki this is your life montage where he got to see like I think it would have been funny if Owen Wilson's character was in that room when they were doing that. He's like, Oh, I like this part and he's just like sitting there like watching it like a fan, like in <laughs> the Infinity War and Endgame and all that. Or I guess oh, I guess not Endgame, it is yeah. for Infinity He's War. like, Oh, you don't want to see this part. He's like <laughs> Yeah, you're he's not like, all like, cool, but fast forward though, this is a good part. Like well, <laughs> Thanos, uh, Thanos travels through time, and which wouldn't that Thanos be a variant? Couldn't they have stopped that Thanos from doing what he did? So many questions. See, that's why uh, you know I wasn't a fan of time travel and Endgame, and I feel like you know this is gonna <laughs> further complicate things. But it's like, when do why you know unless they unless they have some kind of explanation in the series, I'd be fine. But you know if I feel like if they don't address those kind of things, why weren't they? You know, why did they have no problems with time happen. travel and Endgame? And... That was supposed to happen. Well, then who's to determine what's supposed to happen and what's not? Uh... Timekeepers. <laughs> well, yes, but that's a very weak, weak explanation. Well, I didn't say it was good. I just... <laughs> it's like, why isn't Loki escaping with the Tesseract supposed to happen? Like, you know, who, like, it just it doesn't make said, any sense. Like, who decides? We're going to find out that the Timekeepers are the actual real villains. <laughs> they're the big, they're going to be the big badge of the f f Phase 5 or Phase 4, or whatever we're going to do. Or just like the next saga, they're gonna be like the end uh -huh. end villain. Um, but yeah, I'm like, so I'm like that Thanos was in Endgame aesthetically like a variant. So I'm like, you know, are they gonna explain why they didn't step in there? Or are they gonna explain why they didn't step in when Cap just decided to go back in time and no, stay back they there? Knew that and... he was gonna die, so then they probably just they could go and just like reset whatever without having to go and get him. <laughs> well, they didn't reset. This is still our timeline. This is the this is like the main timeline supposedly. 
I don't know. I guess we have five more episodes to see, but I'm not a, I'm not a huge fan of time travel. I feel like that always just makes everything so. Well, so they murky. they give you a lot of easy outs with it, so then they're just like, oh, this is why this happens, and well, it doesn't happen. This not even way. just easy outs, but it also just gives you a lot of like, um, like complications that they just don't really answer. Like, like, like I just said, why, why, you know, why didn't they stop this? Why didn't they, you know, like it, it raises all these questions, and if they don't answer it, then people are just gonna be like, like, well, like you know like what, what's what's the deal there and so i'm like i feel like it makes everything time travel and different timelines and things like that makes makes everything so complicated uh you know i have no problem with like the multiverse and all that if you want to have you know say like oh you know toby mcguire spider-man is in an alternate universe and now they can interact with this one if they jump you know universes or whatever i'm like oh, i'm cool with all of that uh, but it's stuff like this where they're you know people are overseeing timelines and you know time travel in general just it's all so confusing but anyways thank you for uh, listening to uh, my rant because oh, we're still, we are still recording, recording. <laughs> i'm all like yawning and like not paying attention all right well i'm gonna end it now <laughs>